All right, first of all, this says find the perimeter. Perimeter means add up all the sides. So I am actually going to highlight the pieces that we need to add together to find perimeter. We're missing some, we have some. We know this side is seven. We know this is 12, we know a three, we know another seven, but we need to find this one here. If you draw this on graph paper, it's pretty easy because then you could just count the blocks. But for this, I'm gonna look at this seven. And I'm gonna look at this three. Seven minus three is four, which means this side right here is four units, okay? Then the only other thing I'm missing is this part of a semicircle. That's called the circumference. And if I look on my formula sheet, the circumference for an entire circle is two pi times radius. But since this is only half a circle, I'm gonna put a one half in front to get the circumference of just this semicircle. Again, if you put this on graph paper, you would know that that diameter is five. And if my diameter is five and I divide it by two, I know my radius is 2.5. So I'm gonna have to add up a lot of information after I find the circumference of that semicircle. So I'm gonna start by putting the circumference formula in my calculator, which is uh, one half. And then I'm gonna put in that two, I'm putting all that in parentheses then pi and r. Then I'm gonna to go to my next line. This is my information box here. That's all I'm lacking. And I'm gonna put in r equals 2.5. So that gives me the circumference of the semicircle. Oh, I'm sorry, I messed up my stylus. That gives me the circumference of that semicircle to be seven Point nine. So now I'm going to go ahead and put that in my calculator and I'm going to add every single side and I'm going to take my time and make sure I get them all. I'm adding the 7, I'm adding the 12, I'm adding a 3. If you notice I'm circling them every time so I don't miss any. I'm adding the 7 and I'm adding that Four. I've already got my semicircle circumference right there at the beginning. And, oh, I made a mistake. I need to correct that. I put my, my radius in rather than my semicircle. So I'm going to put in 7.9. And that gives me a perimeter of 40.9 centimeters. Perimeter is regular units, area is squared, volume is cubed.